Everybody's ahead of me, so go ahead. You, you pull the, the slack tight around the ring. Now, odds are most of you guys got this right just by pulling on it. You, you did it right. Lift up the spring tensioner plate. Put the belt on it. That's the last step. Make sure that belt is centered on the blade. We're going to practice golden rule number one at Gemini Saw. Rotate that drive gear counterclockwise. If it rotates, you did it right. If it doesn't, you've done something wrong. How's it working? Every, rotating me in the whole assembly. Yes. Or misaligned. There you go. Dictionary? No, I'm kidding. Yeah, I'll, I, I'll do that real quick. Actually, mine's about to do that because I didn't check it correctly. Uh, my belt is getting, I don't know if you can see it, my belt is getting pushed inside. Can you see that? My belt's kind of coming off up on top. You see that? Yeah. The belt's coming off. If I keep rotating this, if I keep rotating it, it goes back on. Um, but if normally, if you keep rotating that, let's say it's off this way, it's either going to come all the way off like mine did, or it's going to get caught. Obviously, when it comes off, you know you didn't do it right, if it gets stuck. And that's just not getting the blade centered in the groove. This is a, another one of my beautiful drawings. Here's a tooth of the blade. There's a V cut in the blade. I'm sorry, in the belt. That, that would be a cross section of the belt, which is, uh, OK, I don't have one. There we go. That would be a cross section of the belt. If you were looking at the belt with one eye really close, you'd see it right there. The blade has to sit in there. The round portion of the blade sits inside that. When you don't align that part, you shove the blade over. It comes off of the raceway. It'll get stuck back here. Kind of like misalignment, you have the blade sitting on top of a raceway. But it's misalignment before the fact. It's not going to go anywhere. So you got to check it. Um, Sometimes it's as easy as taking it off of the spring tensioner, loosening it up, and, and wrapping it back around with your finger, like pushing it back on with your finger. Sometimes it's a matter of taking off the pulley. Um, like, again, down here is really tough. If you didn't do it right, you shove the blade way back there and the belt. So now you got to screw, unscrew these screws and get it back out. Is there anybody here that's stuck, that theirs isn't coming out? And is it not rotating, or you just haven't gotten that far? OK. Um, now, are, how do you? Uh, are you having trouble getting at it, or is it just not working? OK. When, when you're. Once that comes off, you've got to take out the screw. So you have the screw on there, you try and put that back, and then what, what will happen is. Yeah, that's when you call me and ditch it. Yeah, they're, they're, Jesse brings up a good point. You've got to have that screw out, because you want to see what you're doing. You want that room. And also, make sure you wrap the belt around tight. OK, we're, we open up a, a big can of worms. Um, but it's, it's actually the way most people are comfortable because they're afraid. They're afraid of messing up. They're afraid they're not going to do it right. Um, we're going to wait a couple seconds, make sure everybody gets that, and then we're going to do it my way. And as far as I'm concerned, my way is the best way. And no particular reason, it's my way, so it's the best way. So you'll all learn it, or you'll leave. No. We're going um, to, it's, it's really cool, really simple. Because you can be like me, actually, while we're waiting. I'll put the belt on real quick. See, and that was a lot quicker than taking all that stuff off. I feel like a magician. There's nothing up my sleeve. Thank you. Thank you. And you could do this. You know, with a grated chop, you can make a salad. This should be an infomercial. This will probably run on channel 13 at 12 o'clock. Yeah, it's paid programming. Not paid much, though. Want to see it again? Yeah. Let's see it again. All right, is everybody done? Oh, cool. And is everybody's rotate? Yeah. OK. And they, now you've rotated more than once or twice? Because that's what I did, and mine wasn't on right. OK. OK, Jillian, now are you going counterclockwise? OK. You know what? Let's stop here real quick. Everybody turn yours clockwise. See what happens. It, it bobs up and down, right? So if, you, if it bobs up and down, you're not going the right way. Um, really easy way to find out. I can hear that over the phone sometimes when I'm talking to people. I'm like, other counterclockwise. <laughs> exactly. The military counterclockwise. OK, one more time. Nothing up my sleeve. This is great. See, I'm not very talented. There's not many things I can do, but I can do this. And I feel like a man. OK, we're going up and over. I don't have the stature of a man, but I feel like a man. Up, over, around, 
through. Give it a little more here. See that come off? And we're done. I, you know, it, it's just I, I actually am debating with myself whether or not I want to show you guys that because it's the one thing that I have. <laughs> yeah, that's true. You might all be after my jobs. You know, not everybody can have a low-paying, ungratifying job like me. I hate to fly. I get to fly everywhere. You know, do you want that? I mean, it's great. I'm not John Madden. I can't take the bus. Who wants to try that? You guys want to give that a try? Okay, we're taking our belt back off. Let's see if you guys remember how to do it. Because you had trouble. Start from the bottom on the, on the spring tensioner plate, pop it off, start unthreading this thing. I'm not going to help anybody. If you get stuck, raise your hand. We're going to take the belt off. You're going to get the gold star if you can get it off. OK, you get the gold star. i got to make you one. I have no gold, I have no star. We're going to have to purchase a gold star for her. Um, I don't know where. Nah, gold star would be cheaper. <laughs> Sorry. We're not in the business of giving away blades. Only gold stars. <laughs> how, how many people are, have got it done? Two. Almost three. She's there. You're almost there. You got it? Can I ask if you're stuck? Where are you stuck? Nobody's stuck. This is great. This is wonderful. You're showing off. <laughs> I've got it. <laughs> if, if we were in New Orleans, I could throw you guys some belts. But you'd have to keep your shirt on. OK. Do you think you can do it? I don't know. Well, give it a try. If you do it right, you're going to come to the front of the class and do it for everybody. No. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I've got arm guards, and I'll make you do it. Is everybody doing it now? Are they trying it? OK, remember this. When you took your belt off, remember you unthreaded it at an angle. I told you, remember rotation. Roll it through. Put yourself in rewind. Put it in at an angle. Roll it through. We're going to do this. I'm going to unhook this microphone. And I'm going to come around, and I'm going to help everybody do it. Um, that should be OK. Right? So that's what I'm going to do right here, if, if I can find the, uh, the right thing. This is my real voice. OK, who wants to see it first? Raise your hand. OK, wow, you guys are slow. OK, I'm coming over there. I'll work my way over. Did you guys do it? Did you get it pretty easy? Yeah. Pretty straightforward? Just the bottom one was The bottom one's the hardest part. But if you get that blade out of your way, it just rolls right through, right? What I, I went from under here. Opposite way. I'm left-handed, so it's actually easier for you to do it that way. But it rolls right in. It sets that blade right in. You see how much easier that is? No headache, no loose screws, nothing like that. That is going to make you look just as cool as me, if you can believe that. You know? <laughs> it is going to save you a lot of time, though, definitely. I've got a tail. So nobody step on my tail, because. OK. Bottom one's the hardest one. OK. Try it like this, because um, there's another way to do it. If you come in like this, remember roll, remember angle, put it in like this, roll it in. See that? But we're going to take it off and let you do it. Give it a try. But you just learned, you just learned the heart of the saw. You learn how to take it apart and put it back together without any trouble. So there isn't anything here that's intimidating, right? Pretty much? Oh, the resounding yes didn't come that I thought yeah, I'd yeah. There we go. The belt, let's talk about the belt a little bit. Since uh, we're so good at doing this, we can talk about other stuff. The belt is a rubber belt uh, with Kevlar um, that is in the middle of it. It's Kevlar impregnated. There's strips of Kevlar that run diagonally through this belt. So it doesn't stretch. Belts won't stretch. Um, and it's not like a bandsaw, you know, where, where their actual blade will stretch out after a while. You think the belt might. Or the tension comes off because the blade stretches. It's all fixed. Um, barring any problems during shipping or, or anything that we did wrong or anything of that nature, these saws, saws are shipped ready to go. And they stay that way. Um, after you've done any kind of work to a 2.2, and a 2.2 will stay that way. A Taurus 2 sometimes won't, sometimes will. Right. Taurus 2.2. You fill it with water, you turn it on, you're ready to go. It's going to stay that way. You're not going to have a saw bend out of nowhere. You're not going to have an alignment come out or a tension come out out of nowhere. Um, 